Witness! Randon, do you own a chainsaw? Yes, I do. I do. <laughs> I have a funny story about that. I do have a chainsaw, but I have a funny story. Okay. I was... I was biking across Navajo Nation and I stopped off at like a like a grocery store slash Yo Zerker! Good morning, good morning. You guys know Zerker? Zerker is Fleshy's mod. Yo! Happy to see you. Okay. So uh, there's, there's, a, there's a supermarket in Navajo Nation. And they had a little bulletin board. I don't know if you know this or not, but like the bulletin board is like a big thing when you get out of like big cities, suburbs. When you're in the middle of nowhere, like the local store, general store, grocery store, supplies and stuff like that, they have a bulletin board and like there's a lot of shit there, right? So there was one, there was one sign at the bulletin board and it, and it said, Yo, Sushi, good morning. I'm, I'm giving you my, my chainsaw story. It said, professional chainsaw sharpening. Go behind the... It literally said this. It said, go behind the store and ask for Larry, right? And I was like, hmm, right? So I go behind the store and then, you know, there's like two or three open doors and there's like nobody there, right? There's nobody behind the store. So I start shouting, Larry! Larry, there was nobody behind the store, lovely son. I had to ask and then a dude comes out and he's like, you need a chainsaw sharpen? And I was like, no. And he looked at me like I was, because I'm bicycle touring. I don't have a chainsaw. I'm on a bike with like camping gear. And he's like, then why the fuck did you call me? <laughs> and I was like, I want to I wanna watch the next chainsaw that you sharpen. And he called me a fucking idiot and went back in the store. <laughs> he called me a fucking idiot to my face and he walked back in the store. <laughs> he called... <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like Larry, all right. Luna Strea, thank you very much for the super chat. Remember when I said I wouldn't be able to defend you at work? If I didn't wear earphones because of your unhinged comments, that entire Empreg April Fool's segment is why 